Miracle of the Quran and Honeycomb Conjecture Did you know that the honeybee is a maths genius? Yes, honeybees solved the maths problem that took more than 2,000 years for mathematicians to solve. Look at the shapes in the honeycomb. They are all hexagons. Why hexagon? Why not circle? Why not triangle? Why not square? You might ask, does shape really matter? Yes it does. Honeybees use wax to construct the honeycomb. Honeybees have wax glands in their abdomen. The wax glands convert honey into wax. This is where it becomes challenging. Honeybees require 2.5 kilograms to 4 kilograms of honey to make half a kilogram of wax. If more wax is required to build the honeycomb, more honey will be used. What shape can use the least amount of wax but can also give more space? If we go with the circle, we see small gaps between the circles that go unused. So the circle is not the most efficient shape. Well, if we use shapes like triangles or squares, there will be no gaps. Great! But wait, will they use the least amount of wax and give the maximum space? This question troubled the mathematicians for more than 2,000 years and was called the honeycomb conjecture. Only in 1999, it was mathematically proved that the hexagon requires the least amount of wax and also gives the most storage space. If you would like to know the mathematical explanation, you can check the link given in the description. It took more than 2,000 years for mathematicians to understand the best shape, but the honeybees knew this. How? Let's look at this verse in the Quran. And your Lord revealed to the honeybee, build yourselves houses in the mountains, and trees, and what people construct. The verse explicitly mentions that it is God Almighty who revealed to the honeybees about building their homes. The Quran speaks about several other creatures like the ants, mosquitoes, flies, spiders, but only when it speaks about the honeybee, it mentions about the revelation from God to build homes. So it cannot be a mere coincidence. The Quran was revealed 1,400 years ago. Who could have mentioned this 14 centuries ago? If we think about this with an open mind, we can conclude that only the Creator, God Almighty, could have mentioned this. If you would like to read the English translation of the Quran, send a WhatsApp message to this number. By the way, the verse also says, bees were revealed by God to construct homes in mountains. Can bees really drill in the hard surface of mountains? To know the answer, check out the link in the description and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.